In this step, we want to make it look like our candles are glowing a little bit more. And in order to do that, we're going to add an Arnold atmosphere to our scene, which is a really cool effect, and it's one I'm a big fan of. So let's jump straight into it. In order to do this, we actually need to go into our render settings, would you believe? So we'll click on this little icon here to open those up. Under the Arnold renderer, there is a section for environment, and then you can choose atmosphere or background legacy. I like to choose atmosphere, so we'll click on that, and we're gonna choose an AI atmosphere volume. So once you've done that, you can close the render settings and it should give you the settings for that atmosphere in your attribute editor. Remember, it's control and A if you need to open your attribute editor up. And then you need to set a density for it. Now, it's very easy to go much too high with the density. So if I just click, let's say up here, we'll go for 0 0.6. Everything's going to be blown out and it's just too much. You can see that already, even before I let the rendering finish, this isn't really the look we're going for. It might be useful in some contexts, but in this one, I'm not really feeling it. So we need to bring that back down. And the number I've got written in my notes is 0 0.02 as being a good number. You, by all means, can tweak this up or down until you get an atmosphere that you're happy with, but I'm going to try this. There we go. And as you can see, as that's rendering in, the main effect that it's giving us is that the candles now give off a little bit of a glow where they didn't before. And that's really all this step is about, about making everything look better because it will glow now. We're now getting much closer to the end of this. I'm now going to show you two more types of light for the light that we want coming in through the window. We'll start with a sky dome light, which uses an image to provide lighting, and then we'll have a look at an area light, which is the one that I'm going to end with. So I'll see you in the next step for sky dome lights. Game Dev Academy is graciously supported by these absolute legends. If you'd like to offer your support, then check out our Patreon page using the link in the description below.